what's going on guys welcome back to aries edc so if you haven't subscribed to the channel please subscribe you're getting a perfect time to catch the beginning of a huge project for which i am in the middle of doing august is around the corner and i've already started the six rock hoppers for which i am doing the two aeb blades based on the last video have been bevels have been roughly put in and these guys are both ready for heat treat so i'm gonna be shipping these two out in the next day or so just because i want to get them off to peters to get heat treated and then the four edcrv2 blades are all now cleaned up and they're ready to be marked and start putting the bevels on them um, again all four of these are going to be ADCRV2. So I have to mark them and measure and mark out where I want the bevels to start and end. So we got to work on those. So those are going to be sent out. These are going to be here. Um, I know some of you probably are wondering, hey, what's going on with the grinder? So I, you guys are great because as soon as I post a video on the grinder, you guys are already helping me out. Um, so somebody's already told me make sure you tape up that hole so all the stuff doesn't get in to that um, I complained that this platen was or this work table really wasn't big enough um, which is not um, it's really not it's just it's awfully small um, and it just doesn't really work and then this platen comes with like this graphite backer and it's already like coming off so just putting a little heat on that is just not going to do it and then if i put the belt on it just it doesn't work so i've already reached out to somebody who makes a larger table and a different platen for this machine i've already purchased it and that person is going to be shipping that off to me very very soon so new parts are coming for this and i'm looking forward to putting this to work and learning all the great things there is to that again i get to do some really fun things with this machine like being able to take this and turning it sideways and just for an example you have this table how is that going to help <laughs> I, I don't know so the table that i got is triple the size so it's going to be all the way out to here all the way over here it's it's going to be a huge table and it's going to work out really really well so i'm looking forward to getting that in um and getting that done ow pinched myself plus plus check out what i just got today check this out oh yeah air conditioning check out what i just got today guys oh yeah i am ready i got all the belts for it combat abrasives came through comes through again so i got my order of all the belts i need for that grinder so i'm looking forward to getting that to work but i'm using the one by 30 so now it's time to go get those rod coppers started hey guys so i'm prepping the rock hoppers for the bevels um, i was hoping to get a lot more work done by now but unfortunately i wasn't able to get out here and get that done so i'm prepping for the rock hoppers i'm getting them all ready i got the center lines marked out so that um i can start grinding uh, but i have a the live stream in about an hour so I'm gonna hit the grinder and start getting started. Start getting started. I'm gonna start on these <laughs> and get the bevels roughed in, see how far I get. Um, so I have a lot of work. I have to get the four knives, ground the bevels, and then I gotta hand sand all of them, get them prepped for heat treat. It's a lot of work today. I'm hoping by the end of today, to get these ready for heat treat and possibly heat treat. Um, 
that would be pretty awesome. What is going on? Did I not do that side? Oh my goodness. I don't think I did. What happened to that? Hmm. I chamfered all the holes. You can see the chamfering a little bit in the holes. I don't see it on that side. So, I mean, it's not a big deal. Did I do a hole one? Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. That's weird. Well, that takes two seconds, so I'll do that real quick. But um, I'm going to hit the grinder, do some time lapse. I'm hoping this morning before I start the live stream, it will get as much done as I can. And then I'll check back in with you guys at the end of the live stream and see how we did. Um, maybe, maybe uh, by the end of the day, I can start heat treating these. That would be amazing. Uh, I don't want to get too ahead of myself, though, because... I still have those two that just went off the heat treat yesterday and it's going to be a while before those come back. So I don't need to, definitely don't need to rush this stuff. The problem is then if I don't work on these and I don't have content for the YouTube channel. So that'll be more space between videos. I don't know. Also, I've been uh, working on the column shape and uh, I refined that a little bit so the column is I think that's gonna be a pretty cool what do you guys think that'd be a pretty cool little blade I'm gonna put my signature hole up here and that'll be a fun fun little knife and I'm working on that one I got the wood blank for that one as well so a lot of coals on the fire right now a lot to keep me busy but let's get let's get started i think it's uh look it's uh, uh, it's 7 4 in the morning i've already been up at 4 30. i did some work and now it's time to get this guy working and then hopefully soon i'll get that guy working looking forward to getting that guy going so we'll see i got some parts coming i'll update you when it happens guys um it is now eight o'clock and uh i got one one done so i got that one looking pretty good just some refining i need to do on it which i'm gonna throw it back on the grinder and just do some refining in that area got it pretty thin not too thin um, so it looks good so I need to do a sharpening choil and then we're gonna hand sand all of that out and get it cleaned up but I have three more so I'm gonna put this back on the grinder try to straighten that area up a little bit and then I got to get prepped for uh, the live stream and I hope you guys have joined some of the live stream. I know it's on a Friday mornings at about 8.30 Eastern Standard Time. So depending where you are, that might be a little early, but it's, it's the best time for me and I'm not stepping on anybody's toes. You guys can just come in and hang out while I am uh, tooling away, trying to get this stuff done. But um, I hope that you guys can one day join one of the live streams. It's a lot of fun. So, um, 
I'm gonna get started on squaring that off a little bit, getting that a little bit more even. And then I'll set up for the live stream and I'll catch you guys on the other side. Hopefully all four will be done at least. And maybe hand sanded too. I don't know, we'll see. Well, all right guys, there they all are. Uh, pretty successful live stream. It was fun. We got all four of the rock coppers ground. So I got the bevels all done. Just got to clean up the lines, get them hand sanded out and put the sharpening choil on it. And these guys will be looking good. <clears throat> um, so I'll probably time lapse a lot of this because hand sanding and doing all that, it's going to take some time. Um, but they all came out pretty good. They're all pretty thin um, behind the edge. So that's going to be pretty good. Can't wait. And hopefully I'll be able to heat treat and temper these guys coming very, very, very soon. So I am going to go take a break. Air conditioner is gone, but I need to get some food. And then when I come back out, I'm going to try to hit it. I'm going to get them sharpening choils all done and at least as much hand sanding as possible. Um, it does take time, but we will see where this goes. Let's go. Got one down and I got all of the sharpening toils put on all of them and I got this one hand sanded um, hand sanded looking good so before after so I got to get the rest of them to look like this so I will catch you guys on the other side I'm gonna turn some music on I'm gonna vote just uh, getting them focused and I'm going to bang the rest of those out. But they're all looking really, really good. Uh, yep, the rock coppers are going to be pretty cool. All right. Uh, man, that was like brutal. Um, so all four are these are ready for heat treat. They've all been hand sanded. They've all been... Uh, I've taken the grinder kind of resurface the tip we got the sharpening choil in all of them they're all ready to be heat treated quenched and then tempered so I think I'm gonna do that today so what I need to do I need to move my car <laughs> my car is in the way and I don't want to catch my car on fire that's for sure uh, so I'm gonna go prep for heat treat and then maybe I'll catch you guys on the quench been quenched and now it's time to go throw them in the temper and I will catch you all on the next one guys so when you come back on the next video we'll be cleaning these guys up pulling them out of the temper and then seeing what handles I have picked out for these guys so I hope you enjoyed this one uh, please, please subscribe, like, leave a comment, or not. That choice is always 
yours.